Britney Spears fantasy, naked fantasy. It arrived, and I have decided to go over it really quickly for you guys. This is the box. The bottle. Kind of like a whole peach gold nude aesthetic. It is like a frosted bottle. Very reminiscent of Maui Fantasy and Bloom. Um, totally frosted, but it actually has the diamonds. Where Maui and M. Bloom do not have diamonds, this does. So the lid, it is much nicer than some of the other ones. It has kind of a peachy tangerine look. This is silver, really. It's just, it's a really well done bottle. The last few times I've noticed the bottles seem to be a little bit cheaper. Um, the atomizer is a little bit thicker of a metal. Um, those are little things that I noticed the last few years. The perfumes were getting kind of cheaply made, the bottles. So I feel like they got back a little bit of the class. The problem I have with Naked Fantasy is the scent itself is very, very reminiscent of Intimate Fantasy. They smell almost identical. The Biggest disappointment is I thought this was supposed to smell like apricot and peach and pear and apple cider. No. It smells very sugary. It smells very much like fantasy. Um, it also kind of reminds me a little bit of rocker femme fantasy. So when I sprayed it, I got a little bit of musk. I don't get the osmanthus. And I don't really get the peach or the, like, plum or pear, not plum, um, the, the peach. I think it's peach, and I think it is, there's another, there's another fruit. But the peachy apple cider is there. It's just very, very light. Um, it is not juicy, and it's not zesty like I expected it to be. Is it a new scent? No. Is it disappointing? Yes. Um, I would rate the scent 6 out of 10. Longevity, I haven't fully tested yet, so I will be giving a longevity update. For 2022, this is the second up release. The first release is Blissful Fantasy. Out of the two, I would buy Blissful Fantasy. This is the better release for the year, and this is the one that you need. You do not need Naked Fantasy. So, if this is out right now and it's in stock, I would buy this. I would recommend Blissful Fantasy over Naked Fantasy. For sure. So if you're going to go and buy one of the two, I would definitely recommend Blissful over Naked. I still think that this is a good release. I just don't feel like it's a necessary release. This is the better release. So out of the two, definitely Blissful's better. Naked is nice. It's just not needed.